Imagine you have just $1,000 to spend on fixing up your rental property. So where exactly are you going to get the most bang for your buck to increase your property's appeal and its overall value? In this episode from American Landlord, we're going to discuss the best rental renovation for $1,000. This video is brought to you by RealSerious.com where you can screen tenants 24 hours a day the easy way. For starters, it's important to understand that this is not a one-size-fits-all video. Each investment property will undoubtedly have its own unique characteristics comprised of strengths and weaknesses. So, obviously, if an AC unit is broken, then it's worth spending $1,000 to repair it or to buy a replacement if it's a wall-mounted unit. Or if the old living room carpet is beginning to sprout mushrooms or the linoleum in the bathroom is moldy and lifting, then go ahead and put your dollars to work in replacing the flooring. But if all things are equal and the property is in fair condition without any urgent matters requiring your immediate cash, there's one idea that's been studied and proven to show a gain in attracting higher paying renters and will also increase your overall resale value by 5 to 12 percent. So let that sink in. If your property is valued at $400,000, that's an upside of anywhere from $20,000 to $48,000. How? By spending the time and your money to enhance, wait for it, your landscaping. Seems kind of crazy, huh? But don't take anyone else's word for it. Curb appeal is no joke. Just take a look at these before and after images. First impressions do matter. Wouldn't you agree? It's what draws a tenant or a buyer in, especially mature plants that have been strategically placed. So you better roll up your sleeves and get started right away, but don't be all over the map. Be sure to sit down and craft a coherent plan. You'll have to determine which low maintenance variety of plants to choose from for your particular area. And our recommendation is to give a fresh cut around your flower beds, use some fertilizer to brighten up your yard, add some color with annuals and wildflowers, and get some shrubs and trees to add some height. Also, be sure to use a fresh layer of mulch. You don't need to pile it on heavy, you just need to rake it over lightly and freshen up the yard before you list it for rent or for sale. It makes a world of difference and you only need a dozen bags or so to do a small front yard. That's about a $50 bill right there. $100 if you want to include your backyard. You may disagree, but we prefer the red cypress mulch color. It makes the landscaping pop much better than the plain cypress. And if you keep it up once a year, just 12 bags is enough to impress. So if you've got $1,000, be sure to go green and keep it fresh and nice and clean. If you'd like to see more videos about being an American landlord or tenant, please like and subscribe.